Hey, I'm Mark Moore, Memphis Made Masters. Uh, today, I'm showing you what I put down. I, I use this premium horse bedding. I used to buy the kind that had the pine. It smelled really, really good, and it worked really good in deodorizing uh, the area where you keep your puppies at. But uh, uh, this stuff here, it still works just as good. Uh, you want to wait till your puppies get... At least two weeks old, you know, preferably around three weeks before you start putting this down, because you or you gotta really monitor. It. You don't want them getting caught up in their mouth and stuff. But uh, uh, this is my uh, my weapon box for my South African bull. She's already had the puppies. The puppies are about three weeks, three and a half weeks old, or a little over, yeah, a little over three weeks. But uh, I use these two boxes, but they're getting kind of bigger during the time that I'm cleaning out my weapon box. Then I put the puppies over here and I make sure I got some of the horse bedding in there in case they boo boo. Uh, but, uh, all right, so I got a wood, uh, I got some wood up under this blanket here. What I do is I use little bitty screws here and I drill them down all around. These are like moving blankets, okay? So, uh, I made my, um, you see my little weapon boards here. The puppies, they love, you know, flinking to, to the wall. So, this here protected my puppies. I, she, my dog had six puppies, and I didn't lose not one puppy. All the puppies was doing good. Like I say, you want to, uh, I'm going to show you what I got. Got some sheet wood down here. But you see, I, I, ain't, I ain't got it drilled together, you know. So in some spots I do, so you might want to kind of tuck the blanket up a little bit, then screw your screws in. But make sure you screw your screws down pretty good because you don't want the uh, puppies to be getting s scarred up or nothing to land on those screws. So like, this pretty good. It don't really feel bad to the touch of my hand. Uh, this side here is a little high. It's just, you know, just how I made it. But uh, puppies are still big enough now, and they're actually off the mama. They went off the mama for about a couple of days. And uh, the puppies are doing good. They are eating very good, you know. And uh, they, they, you see them, they, they happy. All right, and back to this stuff here. This is some very good stuff. What it does is uh, I'm, I'm going to spread it out in here. And uh, it'll absorb all the pee. Uh, it'll, you know, dry the boo-boo up and the boo-boo will flake to it. It makes it easier for you to keep it clean, okay? So, uh, I'm going to show you about how much I just put it down. And I put it down, you know, throughout the day. Like, if I see one of them using the bathroom, I, you know, throw some up under their butt so, it, you know, if it ain't none where they're using the bathroom at. But, uh, if I see them boo-boo... Like I said, I throw some of this on it, and then I go and sweep it up out of there. Now, you, you ain't gonna be able to catch all the urine. This here is gonna close the smell of the urine, and it's gonna catch a lot of it. But uh, that's when your good blanket come in. But uh, this here, I usually have to change this blanket out like every few days. I got about three of them. Uh, what I do before I take the blanket out, I got my bro, I got my dustpan right there. So I sweep out as much as I can, you know, to clean it out after I remove the puppies out of there. And then uh, I'll uh, drill up my, my screws that I got in. I take the screws out and I just set them over there to the side somewhere. Okay, I ain't got no screws in the middle. Uh, but once I get my blanket up, I say I did get most of this up. I take it and I take it out there in the driveway. Let me show you right quick. Cause I got one out here that I'm actually doing now, and uh, hold up. All right, so here you go the blanket that I just took out. Like I said, uh, the weapon box is only about this long, so this part of uh, it be folded. But it's good, see, it catch some of the wet spots, so it don't go down to your your plywood. But what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna come out here with my backpack blower, and I'm gonna blow all this stuff off of it. You know what I'm saying? And then I got my long water hose right here, and I'm gonna wash it out, and I'm gonna put some different stuff on it. Okay? So, uh, yeah. Uh, 
say I'm, I'm Mark Moore, M Memphis made masters. Check out my bulbs and also Memphis made bulldogs. I got them bulldogs, old English bulldogs coming. So check out my page, like and subscribe it. Check out some of my other videos, share it with your friends. And I appreciate y'all. I'm Memphis, Tennessee. I'm Mark Moore.